lost my hearing 25 years ago um, during my first pregnancy. So I was ready to actually look at stopping working because I couldn't I couldn't cope at work. It was feeling rather rather down, rather that I couldn't bring much to the table. I lost my hearing when I was working in the shipyard. I did an apprenticeship from 16 to 21. No health and safety in those days, no kind of ear muffs or anything like that. The noise was tremendous. I lost my hearing when I was about five years old. Um, I was given a box hearing aid to start with. I remember I wore my anorak all the time and hid it because I didn't want to wear it. We couldn't go to the cinema anymore. We couldn't go to the pub anymore. We couldn't meet with more than half a dozen people at the same time. We couldn't go to the theatre, which we used to do a lot. And until we went through that list, I'd never really realised how many things we couldn't do that we had done before. And it was, it was absolutely shattering. I was, I was in tears. It was, it was awful. Yes. I stopped listening to music 30 years ago. I stopped using the phone 20 years ago. And then I just had a chance meeting with a different audiologist and he suggested I have a cochlear implant. Well, now that I've got a cochlear implant, I mean, it's opened up a whole new world to me. I mean, the first thing I realised was that I could actually hear blackbirds singing. I sat in the garden and I was amazed. I heard a blackbird sing for the first time in 40 years. Um, it took me a year from referral to switch on. I was referred in August 2016. I had the various appointments, assessments, and I was switched on in August 2017. My cochlear implant has been probably the most life-changing element of my life. Um, and the best decision, one of the best decisions I've ever made. Now I have my cochlear implant, the ordinary is just extraordinary. I can hear so many things. I can hear my cat walking along the wooden floorboards. I had my cochlear implant in 2017 and it's been fantastic for not just me but also for my family. It's, uh, it's changed my, my whole well-being, um, my work balance. I can use the phone again, I'm listening to music again. My cochlear implant has also allowed me to pursue um, different career avenues which I never thought would be possible. I rang my daughter and I said, hello, it's me, how are you? And she said, oh, I'm sorry I can't speak. I'm in tears, I haven't heard you say anything like that for at least 10 years. I think cochlear implants are amazing. I think they have brought wonder into my life. And our marriage now, I think, is probably better than it ever was. Oh, I think so. <laughs> uh, I was a, a miserable devil during all that time when I was losing my hearing, and it was getting worse and worse. I was getting more and more introverted uh, and really quite bad-tempered a lot of the time. But now it's, uh, it's made me happy having an implant, and it means that I can relate so much better to the whole family but especially you. <laughs> Life will never be the same again. I'm 51 and I've been given a second opportunity. I've been given another chance. I'm really thrilled that NICE have changed the guidelines. It's going to be so much better because it's changed my life completely and more people are going to be able to benefit from this wonderful technology. Thank you.